And what is your birth date? Wayman James is getting ready for surgery. It's a little cold. The 80-year-old South San Antonian is having shoulder issues that started years ago. The rotator cuff was torn the first time by simply throwing a dart. I couldn't raise my arm to throw the next dart. Well, it's pretty excruciating pain at times. It's almost like a knife drawn in there. Today we're gonna go ahead and do Wayman suffers from arthritis now too. That's why his doctor, orthopedic surgeon Dr. Sergio Viroslav, has recommended a total shoulder joint replacement. A prosthetic made of titanium, plastic, and cobalt chrome will replace Mother Nature's original shoulder parts. So in an 80-year-old who's trying to do things to take care of his family, take care of his house, he needs something, and this has turned out to be a good option for him. Wayman is having his surgery at Mission Trail Baptist Hospital. Time. Dr. Viroslav is using a technique called a reverse total shoulder replacement. In a procedure that takes a couple of hours, he will actually change Wayman's right shoulder joint, taking off the ball of the joint and putting its man-made replacement not on the arm bone, but on the other side. The reverse total shoulder is designed for people with rotator cuff damage and arthritis. It's one of those things that we can now handle something we weren't very good at, let's say 15 years ago, 10 years ago. So this is now a procedure that can help handle both those situations, the range of motion and the pain. Wayman will be in a sling for a couple of weeks and fully recovered in three to six months, able to lift his arm over his head without pain. If it cures the pain and nothing else, that's worth the surgery. Arms up over your head, way up high, high, high. Curing the pain was the goal for 77-year-old Ann Dunman, who had a reverse total shoulder replacement surgery three months ago. I ask you to push up against me. It was hurting all the time. You're weaker on that. Here's a look at her shoulder before and after the procedure. Ann says the care she got at Mission Trail Baptist Hospital was key to her recovery. The atmosphere was just wonderful. I just enjoyed the way the people here treated me when I was here, and it was magnificent. Mission Trail Baptist has been just a blessing for my practice and for patients on the southeast side of San Antonio. Equipment, the architecture, the spaces are all appropriate to help me do the best I can do to help my patients, and that's been great. Orthopedic surgeries are an important part of Mission Trail Baptist Hospital services. The staff is trained and prepared for shoulders, hips, knees, whatever bone and joint problems are causing patients pain. Excellent joint replacements with irreplaceable care. That's the difference. That's Baptist care. For more information, log on to bhsjoints.com or to find a physician, call 210-297-7005. For the Baptist Health News Network, I'm Wendy Rigby.